Yeah, it's been a, uh, it's been difficult. It's been hard because I've just kept this in for so long. Obviously trying to be strong for like my family and his family as well. But I don't know, I don't really know what I had to sort of like put in words how I really feel because it was just, it's just a special time really having that sort of like relationship with Brad's. From that, that sort of like first moment I met him um, and I just couldn't believe that he was actually the, the the young kid that was ill because he sort of like ran over to me. I just think from that from that moment it was just like um, just that instant connection. Um, obviously, I knew he was going to be mascot, but obviously I hadn't seen a picture of him, so I didn't really know. And he just ran over to me. I thought, okay, then this must <laughs> this must be little Brad's and stuff like that. But just his energy um, in the change rooms, bossing the other little kids around and stuff like that. You know, just get great character. But all I can say really, I mean, I speak to you know the family every day. Um, I was with him a few days ago and it was tough to see him obviously suffer like that um, I, in a way I felt, I felt like I was prepared for it because what I've been through previously with my, like with my dad um, but it was just so tough to actually see a kid that you know of that age that's been going through, through this for so long and obviously got to the stage where I mean it's, you know there's a lot of stuff on social media where he's, he's obviously struggling and it's a, I, I can say it's a probably a matter of, matter of days but I mean, it, it, it would always be in my heart, you know, for the rest of my life. Um, and, you know, what can I say? I, I mean, the family know that. Not only me, but my whole family, we're, we're there for the family, you know, even going forward. But it's just, it's, it's difficult, and it, I suppose it puts stuff into, into perspective. Um, I, I mean, there's not a day that goes past where, you know, where I don't wake up in the morning and, and sort of, like, check my phone or think about little Bradley because his love's genuine and I can see it in his eyes when he looks at me. So it's just, uh, it's, it's, it's special, so yeah.